Good evening. It has been a violent Friday in the city of Rochester with five shootings over the last 24 hours. Rochester reached its 17th homicide this year. Christian Garzon spoke with police earlier today and joins us now live. Christian. Adam, out of those five shootings, three were deadly on North Clinton, Bernard Street, and Barden Street. We asked police earlier today if these shootings are connected. Last night on Bernard Street, Ricardo Stone killed. Today on North Clinton, Willie Carver shot dead. On Barden Street, Paris Washington found dead. When asked if there was any connection between the shootings, Captain Frank Umbrio had some choice words. The only connection that we have between the three jobs is a complete lack of moral fortitude and a total disregard for human life by the individuals that, that have committed these crimes. Two other shootings on Stanley Street and Magnolia Street left victims with serious injuries now being treated. Captain Umbrio says so many shootings are taxing their capabilities. We leave no stone unturned on each and every job. Obviously, you know, we don't have infinite resources. This comes on the heels of City Council's vote to cut the police department's budget, a move that prompted a reaction from the police chief. It might give my police officers the necessary knowledge, skills, abilities, tools to go out there and deal with what we're asking them to do. RPD will take a hit of roughly $4 million, or 4%, for fiscal 2021. Police Chief Laurent Singletary says they'll have to take a look at scaling back services. I'm concerned. The two highest years for homicides in recent Rochester years are 2016 with 41 victims and 2013 with 42 victims. For 2020, Rochester is already at 17 murders, but Captain Umbrio says even with support stretched, they'll get the job done. But, you know, we've been able to handle it up to this point, and, you know, if something else comes in, we'll be able to handle that also. Now, no one is in custody right now for those five shootings. Anyone with information is asked to call 911. From downtown, Christian Garzon, News 8. Adam, back to you in the studio. Christian, thank you. Also, Rochester firefighters say they found a body after fighting a fire on McKee Street. RFD says it was an auto body shop and one person died, and they do not suspect foul play at this point.